Imagine you are found in a refugee camp where there is no food, water, shelter. Right in the camp, you have kids who are quite struggling to access quality education. You are worried and scared about the future of your children. We can imagine this together as we sit it here. This is what 50,000 plus people living in Zaleka refugee camp in Malawi are experiencing today. My name is Edward Nyamwela. I'm from Malawi. And I can tell you that Malawi is not a well-to-do country. There are so many people in Malawi who are in great need of support. But even in these circumstances, as scouts, we are able to identify and get committed to help those who are living in vulnerable condition, like people in Zalika refugee camp. It has been our greatest passion to bring scouting in Zalika refugee camp. And thanks to Ticket to Life Project, that has helped us to make our dream reality. You may ask, what's Ticket to Life Project? So, Ticket to Life Project simply brings an opportunity of scouting that it can offer to all young people in vulnerable condition. As Malawi Scouts, it has been our project to take it to the most vulnerable kids and young people in Zaleka refugee camp. I'll share with you three important projects that we are doing in Zaleka refugee camp. These projects, these activities, they are not only building the skills of these young people there, but also bringing an impact to the larger volume of the refugee community. 50% of the people that are living in Zaleka refugee camp, the young people, who are greatly struggling to access their education. They will wake up early in the morning, do the house shows, and from there they'll go, they'll walk four to five kilometers to hunt water. They go back to school tired, and when they're back, they're sent to go and fetch firewood and work in their garden sometimes. And the only time where they can study and work on their homework is, is during the evening. But here's the story. There's no light in their homes. They're nearly school. There's no light. As scouts, we reach out to friends and families to bring solar in their local schools. This has helped a lot that they, in the evening, in their groups, they go back in the evening, study and work on their homeworks. The other project I've also done in Zaleka refugee camp through Ticket to Life is about food for life. Food for life, we have brought these young people together and impact them with agricultural activities in the sense that they are able to produce food for themselves and excess food we are able to sell out in the way that we're able to support our scouting activities. The other foods, we take it to the elderly people as well as those people living with disabilities right in the camp. The last project that we've also been doing with the people living in Zaleka through Ticket to Life has been empowering the women and young girls right in the camps. These groups of people, they have been discriminated against. They have faced a lot of gender-based violences and as well they have been left behind for too long. We brought them all together, 35 of them, and offer them the business skills, entrepreneurial skills. Why? So that they are able to run small businesses right in those challenging times where they are living. Not only that, we have also offered them practical skills where they're able to produce sanitary part so they do not go to the shops, buy where the 
too quite expensive. They save the little that they have. For them to give back to scouting, these women, they have been taking our scouting movement wider in the refugee camp. Where we've seen them opening small troops of scouting, and I'm happy to tell you that we have 500 young kids, young people right in the camps through their initiative. This has been them giving back to the scouting that we have done. In conclusion, all the activities and action that we are doing in Zalika Refugee Camp is through your support. You are behind this impact. And we really thank you all. Thank you.